hello 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 how you doing today i hope you're doing good i am doing fine thank you so much for all your support so today we are going to prepare fried rice with shrimps i saw this on youtube and i said why not try it so i want to try it and i'm very sure the outcome will be great so come cooking with me today and let's enjoy this weekend together we are going to prepare fried rice with shrimps. I have my rice here. I have my shrimps here. So just follow me. I'm not going to display all the ingredients I'm going to use, but be very sure. I'm very sure I'm going to explain all the process and all the ingredients I'm going to use. So just follow me as I cook. Thank you. First of all, as usual, you have to season your chicken. So what I have here. It's my chicken. I'm seasoning my chicken. What is going to happen is that when it's well seasoned, I'm going to put it in my fryer or in my oven, and then I'm going to use the stock water to cook my rice. Okay. So what we'll do next is to put our granite oil and allow it to eat, and a little bit of butter because I don't want the rice to stick together. So I feel this all is too much, so I'm going to reduce the base. This is too much. What to do next is to add your onions. To do next is to add your curry. I'm going to use curry to make the fried rice. So. Add some curry. This is what you have. So I'm going to add some pepper. So the next thing you do is to add your rice, your washed rice. I wash the rice with cold water, so I'm going to add the rice. Just mix everything. Now what you do next is to cover and allow the rice to toast without adding water. So you allow the rice to toast. So after I line the rice or toast for I think one or two minutes, not sure, I don't know. So after I line the rice or toast, that's how the rice looks like. Now you see this is my stock water from my chicken. This is chicken stock water. I'm going to add it now. You can see uh, I have this is ginger water. I I grade the ginger, filter the water out. So this is ginger. I'm going to add. Now here, for me, I like to test if everything is okay. I don't want to cook and then there's no test. Because definitely I'm not going to add. Um, any other ingredients after the spirit. So. This is the period for me. I test to see if the rest is okay the way it is. Now we have to add some cubes, some cubes, maggie cubes. So I'm going to add some maggie cubes here. You can test the rice to see if this is how you want your rice to be before you cover and allow to cook. If you feel this, you add some seasoning, some curry, some maggi, some salt. This is the right time to do it. This is the right time to do it. So now that you've gotten the taste you want, you add a little bit of water. Now you don't 
want your fried rice to be overcooked, so be careful the amount of water you're adding. You cover and allow the rice to cook. Make sure you're cooking in a low. So this is it. You allow your rice to cook. So this is our shrimp. It's like curry a little bit. some salt so what you do next is just take slow and put another pan here what you do next is to put your shrimps the shrimps you just put it Guys, as our shrimp is still cooking, I'm going to go ahead and show you the vegetables I'm going to use for the fried rice. So I have some spring onions here, I have some carrots, and I have some green beans here. So these are the vegetables I'm going to use for the fried rice. So I'm going to go ahead and prepare them. Yeah, I didn't show you this other one. Yeah, I also have this vegetable, so it's optional if you want to use you can use if you don't want. You can do it whatever you have. Some people like their rice full of vegetables. Some people don't like it like that. They just like just country vegetables. I like vegetables, so these are the ones I'm using. This is optional actually. So what to do next is to bring your shrimps. I wish look at our shrimps. <laughs> you know, when the shrimp was, was in the bag, it was looking plenty. So I discovered that when I fried it, the whole thing reduced. So it's not looking small. So I've learned something today. If you're cooking shrimps, make sure you buy a lot because when it's fried or cooked, the quantity reduces. Is the quantity or the size reduces to become small? Look at it, that big bag. Look at it. Okay, so you just add it. Now tell me who will not have, want to have a taste of this fried rice. Tell me! Tell me who will not want to eat this fried rice. Tell me! Just, just the sight alone is enticing. So guys, this is it. 
just mix everything together and your shrimps your fried rice with shrimps is ready lesson learned make sure you buy a lot of shrimps you know fully know well, everybody wants to have a taste of this lovely lovely rice it turned out good guys just just look at it just look at it can you see just look at it see our shrimps there this is perfect perfect it turned out good i love it okay thank you so much for cooking with me today I'm so glad you came by make sure you subscribe to this channel if you want more videos like this let me know in the comment section I'm gonna see you in my next video God bless you